The death of Princess Alice, Countess of Athlone, in January 1981 was the end of an era. She was the last surviving grandchild of Queen Victoria and the longest lived person of royal blood in the British royal family. Born on the 25th of February 1883, Princess Alice was the eldest child of Prince Leopold, Duke of Albany, and Princess Helena of Valdeck Pyrmont. She had one brother, Charles Edward. Alice's father had haemophilia, and Alice inherited the gene from her father. When Alice was just one years old, her father passed away after falling down a staircase, hitting his head and hemorrhaging. Alice's brother was born after their father's death. Alice and her brother were brought up by their mother in Claremont House in Surrey. Her childhood was full of visits to the many relations they had throughout Europe. In November 1903, when Alice was 20 years old, she became engaged to Prince Alexander of Teck, the youngest brother of Mary of Teck, the then Princess of Wales, and the future Queen Mary. Alice and Alexander were wed on the 10th of February 1904, and Alice was escorted down the aisle by her uncle Edward VII. Together, Alice and Alexander had three children, May, Rupert and Morris. Rupert had haemophilia and died from injuries following a car accident in 1928. Morris died in infancy. In 1917, when George V, Alice's cousin, issued letters patent ordering members of the British royal family to relinquish their German titles, Alice, her husband and their children did so. Alice still remained a Princess of Great Britain and Ireland and a Royal Highness in her own right. The King created Alexander and Alice the Earl and Countess of Athlone. After the First World War, Alice accompanied her husband to South Africa and Canada when her husband was Governor-General of each country. In 1957, Alexander died at the age of 82 and was buried at the Royal Burial Grounds in Frogmore. In 1966, Alice published her memoirs. Because Alice was the oldest surviving member of the British royal family, Alice was often consulted on matters of royal protocol. During the wedding of Princess Anne, Princess Royal, Alice was offered to ride in a carriage, but she refused as she felt it was not fitting for a princess of her rank. She travelled by car instead. In 1978, Alice had a fall, hurt her shoulder and was hospitalised for a few days. This marked the beginning of deterioration of her health. By 1980, Alice could no longer walk and on the 3rd of January 1981, Alice passed away peacefully in her sleep. Members from various European royal families attended her funeral. Alice was buried at the Royal Burial Grounds at Frogmore.